Where can I find my Exchange Server settings? Have you ever wondered where to find your Exchange Server settings in Outlook? Knowing this information is essential for setting up your email client correctly. Let's go through the steps together so you can easily locate these settings. If you are using Outlook on a Windows computer, start by opening the application. Once it is open, check the status bar. It should say connected to Microsoft Exchange. This confirms that you are connected. Next, click on file located in the top left corner of the window. From there, select account settings and then click on account settings again from the drop down menu. You will see a list of accounts. Choose your exchange account and click on change. In the window that appears, look for server settings. The server field will show your exchange server address. Now, if you are using Outlook on a Mac, the process is slightly different. Open Outlook and go to Preferences found under the Outlook menu. Then, select Accounts and find your Exchange account in the list. Click on it and then hit the Advanced button. Under the Server tab, you will see the server name displayed in the designated field. It is important to note that, if you are using Exchange ActiveSync for mobile or tablet access, the same server settings apply. If your organization utilizes ActiveSync, these settings will also be needed for your devices. If you find that the server address is missing or incorrect, your email client may not sync properly. Double check for any typos or errors. If you are unsure, it is best to consult your IT administrator for the correct address. For those using two-way sync platforms, such as Surahub, the server details are also necessary for integrating shared calendars and contacts. This highlights the importance of having accurate server settings. Proper configuration of your server settings is essential for ensuring that your email, calendar, and contacts sync seamlessly across all your devices. If the settings are incorrect, you may experience connection errors or sync failures, which can disrupt your workflow. Always verify these details during the initial setup or if you run into any issues. If you have confirmed that your settings are correct but still face problems, you can test your connectivity. In Windows, use the Test Account Settings option in Outlook. For Mac users, reviewing network permissions may help identify the issue. If your setup involves shared resources, make sure that server access permissions are in line with your organization's policies. By following these steps, you can easily find your Exchange server settings and ensure your email client is configured correctly.